There's a lot of people that still come out here. You can see that they, they plant plants and they bring flowers and stuff. St. Adelbert Cemetery on Milwaukee's south side, the final resting place for one of Milwaukee's heroes. He was a corporal at the time. He gained his sergeant stripes while he was in France. Sergeant John Chaika was from Milwaukee and the fourth American soldier to die in World War I. It was a, quite a big deal because he's a hero to Milwaukee and he isn't forgotten. Now, Robert Laplander is working to make sure that we all remember those who fought in the war. The living memories of them are gone now. So people like me, we have to carry this on so that people understand what this is. Laplander heads up the organization Doughboy MIA. Doughboy was a popular nickname for soldiers overseas during the First World War. According to Laplander, there are more than 4,400 MIA cases. Our number one mission statement is to find out what happened to them. Since 2005, Laplander has researched dozens of those cases, pouring over thousands of documents. The letters from the parents are the worst. Uh, some of them are pleading, can you tell me anything that happened to my son? Where, where is he? What happened? Anything. That can get to you. It's those letters that push Laplander and his crew of volunteers to piece together each puzzle. The passage of time, 100 years, they say, Nobody's alive that knew these guys. Why do you care? Because these guys gave everything they had. Just recently, he successfully solved a case, Herbert Renshaw of Maryland. About 5.15 in the afternoon, he was signaling back to one of the other ships in heavy seas, and he was washed overboard. Somehow, his name wasn't included. So for 100 years, the government didn't recognize him. Now Renshaw's sacrifice is officially recognized by the U.S. government. The sense of satisfaction, you know we did something. It, it, we actually did something. As a sergeant, he would have been in charge of two squads. Back at the cemetery, Sergeant Chaika rests peacefully alongside his brothers. Laplander hopes that one day, all those missing in action will find their way home. We didn't forget them. A man is only missing if he's forgotten. In Milwaukee, Tim Elliott, WISN 12 News. Well, they did something important. So fulfilling. Oh, and you can find the entire database of missing in action soldiers online at the Doughboy MIA website. Just head to WISN.com links to learn more.